regarding also in the oral cavity we will study the cause along with its definition and what is the definition of the ulcer ulcer is the sore in the uh, skin or mucosal membrane sore in the skin or mucosal membrane is known as ulcer with the disintegration of the surrounding tissue and what is the etiology behind the buccal uh, or oral ulcer then they are divided into they are the causes the how to remember these all the cause we should remember a mnemonics that is nisabd n i s a b d nisabd tb nisabd tb nisabd means in for neoplasm infection skin skin disease such as um, erythema multiforme and lupus uh, lupus uh, other a for autoimmune disease b for blood dyscariasis and another d for drugs trauma vitamin deficiency vitamin b12 and folic acid deficiency uh, that these are the cause and along with its cause we will describe all the causes for neoplasm we know that all the oral cavity pre malignant or malignant lesion can uh, uh, cause ulcer of the oral cavity so neoplasm as we have discussed also uh, earlier we don't need to repeat it so infection regarding infection it is divided into bacterial infection viral infection and fungal infection and what are the bacteria causing the uh, oral ulcer then they are borrelia vincenti uh, borrelia vincenti then borrelia vincenti can be treated by uh, which uh, antibiotic then um, borrelia vincenti we need to give uh, penicillin erythromycin or metronidazole means uh, you need to remember the porelia vincenti and what are the virus that can cause the oral uh, ulcer then they are um, herpengiform virus herpengiform and herpes simplex virus then these are the virus which can cause oral ulcer and fungal what are the fungus then these are candida can cause uh, candidiasis which uh, causes uh, white plague on the buccal mucosa and uh, regarding the treatment of the bacterial infection we have discussed that either penicillin or erythromycin or metronidazole can be given herpengiform or herpes virus can be treated with acyclovirin uh, acyclovir uh, antiviral drug and candida should be treated with tropical or systemic antifungal drug that is neostatin tropical neostatin and cotrimazole can also be provided so these are the antifungal drugs regarding infection we have finished and uh, talking about the skin disease skin disease we uh, uh, the disease which can cause oral which are associated with oral uh, ulcer are uh, they are erythema for multiforme erythema erythema multiforme and lichen planus uh, this both are erythema multiforme is red discoloration of the mucosa along with a vesical formation and lupus is also they all are uh, just papular vesicles mm, which are present on the buccal mucosa and uh, the most common cause and uh, regarding the uh, very important cause of, uh, of buccal mucosa is a autoimmune disease or immune mediated uh, ulcerative disease of the buccal mucosa that is known as aphthous ulcer aphthous ulcer regarding aphthous ulcer uh, its actual cause is not known but it is regarded as autoimmune disease and the cause can be either infection infection or um, infection can also be the cause or uh, the vitamin deficiency can also cause aphthous ulcer and there is a small autoimmune disease syndrome uh, which is known as basset syndrome basset syndrome is a collection of a symptom which is consists of three symptoms that is g a u genital ulcer aphthous ulcer and the u means and the u in the basset syndrome is uveitis uh, sorry this is uh, genital ulcer aphthous ulcer and uh, uveitis uveitis is the um, basset syndrome and regarding aphthous ulcer you have already knew that the cause is cause can be either any one of this but most uh, uh, most jo sabse zyada apply hota hai wo autoimmune kehlata hai dekhiye uske alawa the next disease can be either blood dyscariasis which is consist of leukocytosis is a granulocytosis uh, leukemia, neutropenia, pancytopenia, these are the blood disorder can also cause ulcer. So, regarding the drug, which are, which are the drug which can cause the, then they are the penicillin tetracycline sulfur drug, barbiturates, penicillin tetracycline sulfur drugs, 
sulfur drugs barbiturates and regarding trauma you should know that um, the trauma uh, either physical trauma like sharp tooth gaze tooth uh, continuous injury can be um, can cause um, uh, can cause buccal ulceration or oral ulcer and the other can be chemical injury chemical injury can be um, either due to aspirin uh, which is taken for toothache uh, to be chewed under the um, teeth uh, that can cause uh, or silver nitrate chemical injury physical trauma chemical trauma and thermal trauma thermal trauma can also cause uh, occult ulcer regarding vitamin b vitamin we have studied that the vitamin b12 and folic acid deficiency can also cause uh, buccal mucosa and uh, what are the uh, uh, some of the mcq points uh, regarding is uh, skin disease uh, erythema maltic for me uh, has a distinct feature which is known as hemorrhagic crust on the lip it causes hemorrhagic crust and other can be what are the causes of the erythema multiforme then usually accepted cause are drug allergy and herpes infection and usually supportive treatment is done for the erythema multiforme lupus uh, planus is uh, purple pruritus polygonal papule on the buccal mucosa and uh, usually tropical steroid is given for the lupus planus so we have we are done with the uh, ulcer uh, of the buccal mucosa now small topics are uh, remaining these are the median rhomboid uh, tongue what is median rhomboid tongue it is the uh, it is due to the developmental anomaly if the um, due to the persistent of the tuberculum impar which was uh, which was uh, regarding a, a, we had studied in the uh, for the development of the anterior one two third of the tongue and if it's persist means tuberculum impar persist then it causes medial rhomboid tongue in which uh, on the dorsal of the tongue there is uh, medial uh, rhomboid shaped uh, absence of the papilla that is known as uh, medial and candida is supposed to be uh, associated with median rhomboid tongue and geographical tongue means uh, it is it causes the erythematous area on the tongue and uh, in which which is the void of the papilla and uh, and the glossitis does not uh, remain stable at one place it usually migrate from one place to another so it is also called as migratory glossitis migratory glossitis and uh, regarded as uh, and treatment mm, there is mm, no treatment required for this mm, geographic ulcer and fissure tongue means there is a fissure on the tongue uh, means the in the medial middle middle of the dorsal of the tongue there is fissure present and uh, this fissure is uh, supposed to be due to the mm, congenital or any vitamin deficiency uh, congenital or vitamin deficiency this feature can be and usually the treatment is uh, same uh, as in means vitamin supplementation or congenital if it is it's congenital then we uh, it can regress uh, on itself and there is a small uh, fall disease spot this is the aberrant sebaceous gland underneath the buccal mucosa aberrant sebaceous uh, fall disease spot is the yellow uh, spot on uh, that is due to the aberrant sebaceous uh, sebaceous gland uh, underneath the buccal mucosa now coming to a very important topic in the in the context of india that is submucosal fibrosis submucosal fibrosis is characterized by juxta epithelial deposition of the fibrous tissue underneath the submucosal layer uh, fibrosis underneath the submucosal layer which was developed in 1953 by Josie, uh, and the etiology is regarded as uh, chronic uh, irritation local irritation done by the petal knot chewing or tobacco chewing or it is also regarded as vitamin deficiency irritation vitamin deficiency and uh, callosan disease can also uh, is also regarded as the cause for the vocal mucosa and other uh, similar uh, like alcohol can be uh, many indian that is that shows that there is racial relationship association with this disease and poor socio-economic status is also associated with some mucosal fibrosis and what does it does then the, it causes the ep epithelial atrophy and um, makes a pre-malignant condition with a leukoplakia and squamous cell carcinoma uh, 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 with it. it is usually associated with leukoplakia and uh, squamous cell carcinoma uh, means uh, 
uh, and what are the stages how it proceed to the um, leukoplakia malignancy so it start from the stomatitis and it causes fibrosis stomatitis fibrosis and ultimately uh, when it undergoes complication it can cause malignancy or leukoplakia fibrosis and then causes complication so this is this was the stages and how does it present its its presentation is very classical so in early stage it usually causes formation of the vesicle which may rupture in the and cause superficial ulcer which was red in color uh, noticed in early stage was red in color and late stage becomes uh, fibrosed and usually gray white in color uh, and early stage had vesicle which ruptured and causes superficial ulcer and late stage you will see fibrosis and scarring and ultimately they also present as a mm, trismus the patient also present as trismus so the treatment modality also uh, depends on these uh, symptoms uh, steroid is usually dexamethasone uh, injected in the affected area bi-weekly for 8 to 10 weeks and avoid irritant like achieving knot, beetle knot, O, which was taken as a and treat the anemia condition. And surgically, you need to you need skin grafting uh, and cover with a flap. Means uh, simple release of the fibrosis is done with the skin grafting. Uh, skin grafting can be done. That was the treatment for surgical treatment. Surgical treatment means ultimately um, you need to if it persists for a long period, and then you need to. Uh, go for surgical treatment by um, surgically uh, excisioning uh, means uh, flapping out the fibrosed portion and uh, skin grafting by doing skin grafting and um, this is all for uh, buccal mucosa portion so uh, thank you